All right, everyone. So things have gotten wild with this NFL top 100 list. So yesterday, the top 10 was released and all hell broke loose when they were releasing the top 10 and Patrick Mahomes came in at four. So remember, these are players voting on who they think is the best in the league. Mahomes gets put in the top 10. He's number four. Everybody kind of thinks that he should be number one, right? That's the going narrative on Twitter and everywhere else. So they're all very upset about this. So Nick Wright tweeted this out. This also means the top three is Tyree Kill beat Mahomes in round one, beat by Mahomes in round one. Lamar Jackson beat by Mahomes in the AFC championship game. Christian McCaffrey beat by Mahomes in the Super Bowl. Are all listed ahead of the two-time MVP, three-time Super Bowl champion, and three-time Super Bowl MVP with three of the hands-up emojis. So Tyreek Hill seeing this tweeted at him and said, go cry on set tomorrow with crying or with the laughing emoji. And then um, Nick Wright sent him back three facepalm emojis. So Tyreek Hill was kind of going at haters last night. He really thought that, you know, he did deserve it. And he was going after all sorts of people, you know, that were kind of, because everybody was, it seemed like there was like a universal people were saying that this list was garbage and it was terrible. But it is something to be said. You know, th th this is why, to me, this this matters, okay? This is why this really, really matters to me, is that this is players picking, right? These are players voting. And you could say they have no clue what they're talking about. You could say they're wrong. You know, certainly in terms of resume, Patrick Mahomes should be number one, you know, like going away in a big way because he's the number one, you know, he's been a two-time now back-to-back -back champion. He has a, a championship from before as well, but he's won the last two seasons. So it's tough to say, yeah, he shouldn't be number one. But I think it matters that he's where he is just based off the fact that these are players voting. You know, if this was like media voting, you could be like, I don't know what's going on here, right? Media, you should have Patrick Mahomes as number one. But when you're when players put him at four, I do think it says something. And the fact that it says something that Lamar is ahead of him as well, that tells you something else. Now, part of it could be, players kind of getting a little bit of a hatred for him, right? You know, he's so successful, they're kind of beginning to dislike him in a strong way. That could be part of it. It could be that players just think it's worse to play against Tyreek Hill, worse to play against Lamar Jackson, I guess, right? Because maybe Mahomes is just beating up on the same old people all the time. So those people are like, you know, whatever. They're going to vote for him, but nobody... I, it's kind of a... It is a shock, right? I think it's one of those things that... It's a shock. You can't really figure out exactly why he would be fourth. You know, if he was second, that'd be one thing. But fourth, that's pretty crazy. But it matters. And it's a story because this is picked by the players. And so we'll see what kind of comes of this. I'm interested to read, you know, because obviously it's the weekend now. So you don't have any of the talk shows talking about it. It's going to be interesting because this is going to probably be the number one story on every talk show, you know, Monday. And it's going to be interesting to see the different takes on this and why people think this was the case. So thank you all for watching and we'll see you next.